Christmas cards are just the last thing anyone thinks of during a heat wave. Anyone, that is, except the people who make them. And very ingenious many of the cards are. There's a huge place in the home counties which is already well on the way with Christmas export orders. Artists rack their brains every year to think up something new, and no sooner thought up than the cards go into mass production. And most important of all, it's largely produced for export. Two million Christmas cards every week go from here to 20 countries, almost all over the world. And that's an angle known to hardly one in a thousand of the millions who choose, buy, post and receive cards every December. Only the use of the latest conveyor machinery enables the manufacturers to keep up with the always increasing demand. At this time of the year, the warehouse is bulging with a couple of million cards awaiting dispatch. Understandably, Commonwealth countries are big buyers. But it's surprising that in so many places with religions other than Christianity, the demand is brisk and growing. There's a lot to be said for our climate after all. Fancy having a second helping of Christmas pudding in burning Kuwait. 